you can use uh, an external camera like a DSLR or some sort of outside camera, or you can use a webcam, which you described it as kind of this full auto, you know, all in one mm -hmm. package. You're kind of up and ready to go and start streaming in no time, right? So what, what are some of the things that people, if they want to use an external camera, that they might not be thinking about? Like I know, for example, for me, you know, I didn't know that I needed to get like a capture card to connect my HDMI camera into my computer, for example. Right. Yeah. Well, so getting it into the cam, getting it into the switcher, into the computer, you know, your webcam has that all built in and you might think that that's super easy. But um, if you bring if you're bringing in a high end uh, studio camera or even a medium range studio camera, a DSLR or something, you've got to contend with the HDMI output, for example, or an SDI signal that needs to get encoded into the computer so that that signal can be used and so you can you know play with it and do all the great manipulation that you want to do with it so you can put a you can put a capture card inside a hardware computer um, you can connect it via a USB dongle or a Thunderbolt and that gets the signal where you can work with it